Hey, I'm Ed. Today we're going to make coleslaw. All right, so step one is to take a cabbage, a head of cabbage, cut it and shave it, and like make thin slices out of it. So I just chop it in half first, and we're just going to do this. Uh, however thick you want it, you can do that if you want a little bit more chunky. You can make them a little bit thicker than this. All right, next we're going to just prepare the other uh, salad ingredients. So I'm just going to shred up the two carrots and just thinly slice one red onion. So you get little tiny like shreds and then they're going to go right in the bowl. Okay, so here's our sliced red onion and our shredded carrot. Just boom, right in the pot. And now for the dressing. All right, now we assemble the dressing for the coleslaw. Super easy. Juice of one lemon. Cup and a half of mayo. Quarter cup of mustard. Tablespoon of cider vinegar. And a pinch of sugar. That's it. We just stir this bad boy up and put it on the salad. And then we mix it all together. All right, now here's the fun part. We put the dressing on. Now we're going to just mix it up. I like to get my hands in there. I like rubber gloves if you want to keep a little clean. We just put it in there and we let it chill for about maybe two hours in the fridge. That way uh, the coleslaw will break down a bit and absorb the dressing. All right, so here's how we serve it up. Take a little pulled pork, put on a little potato bun. I love these things. A little bit of our homemade coleslaw. And the sandwich and our homemade barbecue sauce to star of the show. I, uh, after I boiled it, I actually ground it up a little with a stick blender. You could chuck it in a regular blender when it's cooled off or just throw it in a bottle or a, a jar, an old jar or something. And here we have some massaged kale that we also made. Bon appetit. Thank you.